Hi, this is Dan, and I'm here with more Let's Play of Monster Train. So, I'm still working on a Hellhorn slash Umbra uh, victory here at our current uh, Covenant level. So, okay, let's see what we've got. got. Those cards, some of those are okay, some... Well, Demons getting multi-strike is very powerful. Uh, yeah, so we're gonna do that, and <laughs> we're gonna try to get some demons. Um, okay, and I think this champion is good, the, uh, the armor slay, um, the armor tr trigger on slay, uh, gets some survivability that, uh, wouldn't otherwise have, so unit draft is very good, because it's a chance to get a demon. So it's, you know, dangerous, obviously, that they're getting <laughs> extra attack, but... Um, so I think let's set up up here uh, to at least give them one turn for their um, rage to uh, wear off. Alright, well, not the greatest morsels. This is a great time for this imp to show up. <laughs> and I think we'll get rid of it so that um, this uh, goes to the right guy. I guess, yeah, if there's five of them, they're each doing seven. That's a lot of damage. Uh. Yeah, and we're only getting one slay trigger there. Alright. <laughs> So I'm gonna send this imp up here because uh, I want to protect the pyre. got him killed, so it's a good chance we'll be able to finish the job up on the, uh, the next floor. <laughs> yeah, okay, and we're already, uh, we've already won. Was, uh, very nicely done. No damage to the pyre, and we get our unit. Uh, so I think we've already got one of these. It is really good though. And I mean, a double stack on this is going to be worth more than a double stack. How many do we have? We've only got one. Let's add another one. Uh, I 
do like the packed morsels. It's a way to get a jump start. Alright, well, this guy's a demon. Um, and he gets armor on his own, so I guess we'll do that. Alright, so over here we can get an Umbra unit, an upgrade. Hmm. Like, we know we want to kind of focus on demon units. Um, so, improving this guy would be good. Yeah, I mean, I'm trying to talk myself into going over here, <laughs> but I think this is the smarter play. Uh, Morsel Master, you can join the team. Alright, well. You're. I guess we'll make you large. <laughs> um, these I'm not crazy about. I mean, rage would be good if we had the. Uh, the rage doesn't decay uh, relic, but we don't have that yet. And we may never get it. Uh, so I'm just going to skip this and save our money for later. Because I'm not in love with those upgrades. Yeah, I mean, even the. Um, Ugh, enter with spikes three. Uh, I, I, I think we are not going to do that because HP is sort of our weak uh, weak point here. I mean, we do have some ways to get armor. But. All right, so Hornbreaker Prince. Go here. And some more souls. Yeah. So let's put him up here in case the uh, collector shows up. Uh, we could do the molting imp now, but I th think it's better to save it for later when it'll do more good. This guy's gonna fill our deck with stuff, but um, but this guy will finish him off later, so I think it's okay. Uh, we want the money. I think Morsel Master is a good friend for you. Alright, and not the greatest morsel. We need some, some cards that give better quality morsels, I think. Is uh, the next thing I'm looking for. Actually, maybe I should have put those in front to tank those hits. Steel is going to be useful. I guess we might as well put this guy here. those guys and this gives us a little extra armor uh, I think we'll just do it like that so we probably win on the next floor although I mean if you got up to this guy I think he's tough enough that uh, Oh, 
Oh, wow. I, <laughs> I thought that uh, this guy would have had everything taken care of, but apparently not. All right, so we win here. Let's just hit the, uh, the end turn button. Hmm. I mean, I do like Rage. Yeah, we'll get him, and there's a chance uh, if we get Consumer of Crowns, he'd be a good demon to have. So, I mean, this is the quality Morsel is potentially asking for. The other alternative is this. Uh, enhancing a unit is good. I've never gotten this to work well, but uh, let's try it. With multi-strike, things that enhance attack are really good, so... Alright, well... Uh, I guess let's go this way. A random imp. It's interesting. Or... Gain attack on... Ca I'm going to get this, because it works well with the multi-strike, which we theoretically are getting a lot of. Uh, second Morsel Master. I, I've done this before and it kind of works pretty well. Um, you sort of stack two of them together and you get three Morsels instead of two. And if you get some high quality Morsels, that's a lot of good Morsels. Ooh. Well. I mean, I guess... We can make this guy gigantic. <laughs> there will be room for him. He would only take up five spaces. Yeah, let's do it. I always go for the small one, so let's let's go this way. Alright. <laughs> So that's pretty good. He's he's very powerful and he makes his own armor. <laughs> and we definitely do want to get some more demons though to get the maximum use out of this thing. Um, so I, I think setting up on the bottom floor is basically would be throwing away our champion. So we're not going to do that. We're going to set up on the middle floor. Morsel Master. Shade Splitter. Alright, Damage Shield is good. Get a little extra armor. Okay, well, um, I guess let's set this guy up on the ground floor. Second Morsel Master. All right, I think that all works. Six available. I guess they're train stewards. So four 
Train stewards. Oh, imps. That could be maybe interesting. Um, uh, sure. Let's just try this thing. Alright, so we're going to get a very powerful train steward up here. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have to get rid of some of the, those uh, train stewards if we want that spell to... Hit better units. Right, of course, could also add the better units to the deck is uh, <laughs> it's a step there, as well. All right, well, I think killing the bomb is going to be useful. All right, let's see if we can get another. Better one. Yeah, this is better. Oops. Overshot the floor. Yeah, so we are a little bit capacity constrained, but I think it's okay. So our imps are kind of not relevant, so I think we're going to have to take a capacity upgrade. This guy should just tank a hit there. <laughs> All right, final wave, and we've already won. So let's just let it happen. In fact, I'll speed it up. Yeah, so a multi-striking gigantic demon is pretty good. Even though, you know, he's not the top tier demon. But he's doing good work. Uh, I, I mean, it's kind of like going with the theme. Um, I don't know if we're going to have the energy to make it work, but I'm going to try. Uh, I think we've already got... I think we've got two Morsel Masters, right? Yeah, we've already got two Morsel Masters. I think three would be overkill. Well... Yeah, no, three would be overkill. Uh, so let's just take the money. Uh, and I, d I don't want to have to supply morsels to these guys, so, uh, and we want demons anyway. Um, now, do we want the capacity? Uh, um, yeah, I think we're going to need it. If we, if we do get more demons, we just need more space for them. All right, so we're gonna. I would like to get some of this stuff, but we've got to go this way because this is a potentially a demon unit. All right, well this uh, this is actually interesting too. But getting multi strike on this guy very valuable, and getting extra multi strike on this guy very valuable, uh, and then. I think making it, I mean, getting, making his attack better is 
uh, is good in the early game, you know, or like when he first gets out, but he also needs some survivability because uh, he does scale up on his own. So I think, yeah, let's do it like that. Um, I mean, not terrible for the Morsel Master to be able to do a little bit more than he normally does. Um, so he gets 15 armor and range or over here he's getting a slight trigger I think the armor gain is still really good because uh, that's what I think the uh, the the biggest drawback for the hellhorn is I think survivability so that's why I'm obsessed with it. Uh, 150 coins. Um, mm, yeah, I'll do it. Yeah, we just got, you know, more HP on a bunch of our units, so we ought to be able to handle this. Okay. Um, so we could put Alpha Fiend down here. Actually, I mean, it's maybe interesting to even give him a Morsel Master. Hornbreaker Prince up here. Uh, hmm. Yeah, so I'm not crazy about um, yeah, the amount of damage. <laughs> that we took there. Uh, okay. Well, we've got to do something to protect him. Uh, but we can do that with just tanking hits with morsels. So, all right, this guy can go there. And actually, uh, so what's going on up here? We're dying. Well, that's not good. Okay, so the Morsel Master is not going to get out. Alright, so he survives. And he survives. And unfortunately the Pyre takes some damage. Alright, we basically just need to tank this first one, but there's no way to mix and match. Uh, and up here, we're dying again. Okay, uh, 
those are full up. This is only get, probably going to get imps or train stewards, so I don't think that makes sense. Um, yeah, you, this guy needs healing. Uh, even though it's going to be bad next turn uh, with the ember, ember drain. Um, like, this is him not being able to take a hit has been the reason everything has been getting by, because we have to sort of like pull out all the stops to save him every single turn, and he's not scaling up because of it. armor, some rage, and yeah, get lifesteal too, why not? Alright, so we've won So that kind of worked, um, but it took too long to get going, I think was the big problem there. Alright, apply 20 armor is good. Um, or rage 4 and armor 5 is also pretty good. <sighs> the piercing. Well, you know what? We occasionally get life steal, so I think that kind of works. Uh, feast is interesting. We can maybe get back some more of our high quality morsels. No, I'm thinking backwards. I'm thinking <laughs> feast is not interesting. Uh, so let's not do that. In fact, let's not get any of these. I was thinking if regurgitate <laughs> the other zero cost thing. Uh, because the reason I was thinking that is uh, a while back I was thinking like, if you can get feast and regurgitate at the same time it's sort of an interesting dynamic um, yeah, so we could heal the, heal the pyre which would be good but I think over here there's potential for more artifacts I think getting lifesteal too um, is going to help us with that setup stuff that, that I've been struggling with. Alright, so getting double stack on... Well, this would be interesting to have double stack on it. Uh, if we could ever, uh, if we could actually play this and get multi-strike 2 out of it. Um... I think this makes more sense. Armor 20. Um, that'll make it cheap. Alright, remove the consume on this. And then upgrade it. Or make it free again. 
Uh, this... I don't think we want to... I don't think we really care about the torches that much. Let's um, get rid of some of these train stewards. And we're spending all our money here. I'm not sure that's wise, but... I don't think those train stewards are doing anything good for us, so... Hmm. We do have some heavy hitters, so I'm going to try this. It's Obviously it's risky, but an artifact is really good, so... So, Alpha Fiend. I think what we were doing before is, was kind of working. Um, so, let's just do it again. And we'll do the double Morsel Master down here with our Alpha Fiend. And uh, there, that didn't exactly work the way that I was supposed to, but... Here, now this guy takes care of the one in front. Uh, well, hold on. I, we will... Well, actually, we could get that guy with the torch. We don't need to use the unit. So, let's get the second Morsel Master here. And then we torch this guy. Yeah, we're good. great one. In fact, so let's use it to tank a hit. Oh, this guy's a sweeper anyway. Huh. Oh, whoops. Yeah. <laughs> I'm all discombobulated. Um... Alright, well, the only thing this can do is kill this, that unit. Good. I guess we might as well use this guy. No, 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 no. What am I thinking? <laughs> We've got two morsel makers. This is the whole reason that they're here. Oops. Is to fill this guy with good morsels. Or morsel masters, not morsel makers. Uh, yeah. Shield is good, so let's give him damage shield. No more room there.
All right. So I think this Alpha Fiend ought to be able to take care of whatever's coming here. Uh, yeah. And <laughs> give him even more life drain. Or life steal. Summon ability. Oh, well, I mean, that's good with our imps. If we could ever actually use them. Uh, double the amount of rate. Well, well, this is interesting. This is also interesting to me. Because the problem we have with uh, morsels is uh, capacity, but this lets you sort of override the capacity. Here, you put one, put a good one down, and then you can use that spell to widen out beyond your capacity. Uh, all right, spell upgrades or unit upgrades? I'm not sure that we have anything amazing and that we need to do for unit upgrades spell upgrades would be would be better um, but healing the pyre would be better Ugh. this way we get money let's go over here Right, so we could remove the consume on something, make something cheaper, something more powerful. I mean, if we're ever going to play it, it, I guess it does need to be cheaper. Um, and this is not necessary. We want to get rid of these uh, train stewards. There's just no room for them. You know, if we could actually, now that I think about it, one unit upgrade we could do with is um, if we made the uh, uh, the Rage Imp endless, that would be quite good. Yeah, and with three attacks per turn, this guy scales up super quickly, so I think it's okay. Muscle Master. Muscle Master. Then I, I would like to give him a morsel. There's, there's a good chance it'll be an energy imp, and this... Uh, this one actually do what I want it to do. Well, it'll it'll make them in the ballpark of killable because of the extra armor. 
they got from Fel. Uh, if they hadn't gotten that, that would have been my plan, was just kill them there. Steelworker, you go there. Molting Imp, you're good. And then we might as well sacrifice you. Uh, I'm not sure this is really worth anything. What's, I guess what's available is another Imp, right? Fledgling Imp. So I don't think that really fits anywhere. Uh, so, but this does fit right here very nicely. And uh, you know what? I should have looked up what was going on up here. Yeah, I should kill this one. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> oh well. Is the worst time. Oh, whoops! Shouldn't have encanted that guy. Oh well, didn't didn't make a difference. He's gonna take two pyre hits anyway. Yeah, I mean, it takes us a little while to get started, but this guy is, you know, gets amazing by the end. And the problem is, we don't have a way to stop, you know, these sorts of guys from getting to the top. And the statues, obviously, were a big factor on this one. Which is not gonna happen every fight, but... Uh, so close to having that. Um... Well, this guy does harvest, but it doesn't matter because he'll be dead by then. So let's just do this. And then this guy also benefits from being more powerful. Tough to drag that one up there, uh, but so the reason I like that is it also triggers his uh, revenge ability. I mean, it's probably not going to be relevant because it gives him rage, which will wear off by the time enemy units actually get there. But.
So let's see. We're only going to get one more because of the capacity limit. But, and they're the only. This is, these are the only morsels on the board right now. So. Uh, and then we might as well kill this guy. Put a little extra damage on Fell. Oh, whoops! Except we didn't because he's got armor. Uh, yeah. Give some benefit. a little bit gratuitous, so let's do it. It's always nice to get over 100 damage uh, per hit, so... You get another one. Um, this is probably better. I'm gonna take this because I'm greedy, and then I'm gonna take Ember, so that we might actually be able to make it work someday. here a lot of artifacts which is good here's card removal which I think is not as important so friendly units get armor 5 pyre starts with armor 15 now the the interesting thing here is um, this is uh, our, our morsels will also get armor 5 so that would make them better tanks um, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Um, restoring pyre health is good. We do have a few consumes. with rage th I mean this is actually also interesting from a morsel perspective it's it would be suicide on against spiked units um, but you know just be a, t a little bit of extra damage all the time uh, and we do have multi strike on our demons which is good I don't know, uh, and I mean this is, you know, 40, I, uh, the power needs healing, um, so this is certainly valuable. I'm gonna get this, I don't know, I, I think it might be too much greed there for my own good. 
Okay. Well, so this is interesting. Do we want a multi-strike? Or do we want just the more straightforward? I think this is more survivable. Especially because we've got... Um, our demons are, are our focus for the multi-striking. So, let's just do this. So on each floor, wilt wings, we get 400 coins. These guys are a pain, but they aren't. Well, uh, they would if they get up to the pyre, they're gonna do their extinguish damage to the pyre. So I don't think we can do that. Well. Uh, we have imps that could. All right, this is super risky. I I I feel like I just made a bad decision there. Um, but there's a possibility it'll really work out. So it's kind of a high risk, high reward move. All right, well, we didn't get the imps we wanted. We really didn't get anything we wanted here. Uh, I mean, this guy is gonna have to go down here for the long term. Yes, let's uh, tank up our champion. And actually, let's tank some hits for our champion. Uh, although, yeah, this is going to move him to the front. I should have done this in a different order. This does no good, but maybe by the next turn we'll have another thing. Yeah, so we're, we're taking 30 pyre damage. It really sucks. This is, I was hoping, you know, that we would get the one card that would solve the problem, but we did not get that card. Yeah, and if these guys get up there, we're, we're dead, so... Alright, well, at least, I mean, on the upside, uh, at least our champion gets to attack. Um. Alright, well, this guy needs to get out here. Ugh. Not a good situation. This guy, I think, I, I don't know how we can stop him. Like, our pyre is going to be so weak. Yeah. So. <laughs> This is... Oh, he's dying. Because this guy's gotten hit so much, he has been enraged quite dramatically. So he can actually kill someone. Awesome. Uh, okay. So, Morsel Master. You get down here. Um, yeah, I'm going 
gonna set this guy up here. So that next turn he'll be able to get the one in the back. Drain is a problem. <sighs> okay, well. Luckily, what we did last turn is working out because <laughs> we have no ability to change anything. Okay, so these guys are the ones that we needed on turn one. So they can show up there. That works, he's killing him. He's dying, that's actually not bad. All right, he's okay, and the uh, this is actually the only one that's still in our hand is this guy, so him being enhanced is quite good. All right, okay. Uh, six pyre health is obviously very, very, very bad. <laughs> but I think we've kind of stopped the bleeding. to sacrifice, so. Alright, hopefully we set things up so that we win. Or, you know, that it's good enough for a win on the, uh, the fight. Yeah. Okay, this guy's dying. That's good. This guy's not relevant. This guy, we're not killing him. Uh, so, what is... That didn't change things as much as I hoped that it would. And I probably should have put those in front. We could have tanked a hit. Alright, yeah, and this is, <laughs> this, yeah, that helped a lot. Yeah, the downside is you don't normally want to be attacking this guy with a multi-striker because uh, he gets more powerful with every hit, but we also get more powerful with every hit, so it's kind of... focus and my mouse wasn't responding there. Uh, Alright, so we've won. So I'll just hit the thing. <laughs> Alright. Six is a scary number up there. 400 is a nice number down here, but I think I probably should not have given into the greed there. Um... And the rage is okay. I 
guess we'll take it. Uh, none of these really help. Alright, so we need to go over here for the Pyre Health. And we can also see what's going on. Trinket-wise, or uh, artifact-wise. Um, I mean, this is, this is okay. This, I guess, would help with imps. Um, these don't really seem amazing. Uh, I'm a little tempted to um, just hit reroll. Uh, let's see what's available in the spell shop. Hmm. Alright, I'm going to hope that we get better choices here. Well, I mean, this is good. So I'm going to get that. Morsel Miner is not bad. Um, I don't know if it's worth 235. So let's go over here. So we could remove consume on these things. I don't think it works. I'm gonna try. <laughs> Hopefully, we'll at some point get those to go off. Uh, and we might as well reroll. Duplicate our cheapest tome. Yeah, uh, I am not super confident that uh, the 26 pyre health is way, way, way too low. First spell gets consumed, so I'm probably going to forget that. But we do have a bunch of spells we don't care about, like our torches and uh, spells that consume by default. So. I think our standard setup is good, so... So we should just play our game in that sense, and then let's... Oops, because we can kill this guy in the back, let's do so. champion the most because this guy gets his own armor plus he got the damage shields when he came in guys are doing damage, but they're not killing them. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, I mean, with the cards we had, that was the best we could do. Ok, 
Okay. Uh, I mean, obviously this is a good time for this molting imp to show up. So that saves the pyre for now. Um, man, I really want to get this thing going, but I also don't want to lose this. Um, yeah. So we'll do that like that. so aggravating. I want to use these things. Yeah, the entire thing I've trying to been build to, building uh, build towards. Um, I just can't do it with the enemy we drew. Um, so okay, so I think I'm gonna use this to kill the guy in the back. We need to protect the pyre. Huh. As actually, I didn't it didn't fully, I didn't know before I made that move that it was going to actually result in all of them dying. I thought one of them was going to get up to the pyre. Whoa! Uh oh! I also did not realize that that was happening. So that's a huge disaster. Uh, I hate this. This um. This deck full of garbage mechanic is such a pain in the ass. Uh, it's. I mean, this will kill more here. Yeah. Um, man. Because like it, it hurts you in so many ways. It's it eats your your um, ember, and it reduces your cards. It's like a double whammy. It's just such a I don't know. It's like anti fun. Uh, well, I guess we'll do that to consume it. Um, This guy needs health. I'm gonna give him the life steal. Oh man, I, I think we've lost, but I'm annoyed. It's like the the only way you can deal with this is if you have you know if you've been investing in card draw. So it's like if you don't, there you just can't get going fast enough. And it's just it's frustrating. It feels like you can't play the game that you've been trying to play. Yeah. I, don't know, I shouldn't be whining, but... <sighs> yeah, and this, uh, I can't, like... So there's, there's nothing we can do about this guy. Like, 
if I had been, you know, on an earlier turn, if I'd been able to give multi-strike to this guy, or if I'd been able to keep, you know, it's like, but you can't, because you have no ember and you have no cards, and it's like, well, all right, so I just lose then. Um... I mean, like I said earlier, we really lost this on the previous fight where I threw away all our HP to get 400 gold for you know, the chance at uh, artifacts, but the artifact shop let us down too. So. sour note. It's kind of like I was trying to make the best of a bad situation. It's like, well, all right, we've invested in these tomes. Let's finally at least make it work in the final battle. And it's like, nope. So, yeah, that was... Uh, oh, hopefully uh, <laughs> that sourness uh, doesn't mean you didn't enjoy it. So I hope you did enjoy watching and I hope you come back next time. Bye.